hello everyone so welcome back again and today we are going to do the configuration of switch on real time okay so dear all this is our console cable on which we can see that this is our console part and this is usb port that will be inserted in my laptop again okay so let me connect the console cable uh, in the console port okay this is the console port here you can see that console is written over here okay on this side i have a laptop let me connect the console cable in my usb port okay this is a layer 2 switch on which uh, there are 24 ports are available okay so let me start doing the configuration in my laptop and we will we're going to configure what the vlan on these devices on the switch okay so so dear all we have just connected the uh, console cable to the switch okay and in my laptop i have just connected what a usb port so i will go to device manager okay and let's see which port is available for the configuration from the switch okay here you have to click on com port so you will find a serial port inside that click on serial port okay it will show that device is working properly okay let's go to port setting okay so this one is what so everything is working perfectly okay serial port is available now let's go to uh, putty on which you can by the help of that you can do the configuration okay here the com port 3 is available to connect here to connect the com port you must define that which port you are going to configure from which com port you are going to configure so it is com port 3 so you have to mention what serial com port on this side also okay let me do the same so for that you have to click on what serial and click just type here com port 3 as you have received the details in what in your usb port okay com port 3 now you have to press what enter now the port putty will open up and this is your switch interface hello everyone so we have just taken the console access okay now we are going to do the configuration on switch to create the vlan okay so first of all you have to go to put a command enable to forward in privilege mode <clears throat> in privilege mode you have to put a command configuring terminal for the global configuration mode here first of all you have to create the vlan now the question is that how we can create the vlan by putting the command vlan 2 okay i'm creating what vlan 2 press enter and create give a name to its vlan let us assume the name of vlan is what hr deva hr that vlan we have created for hr department okay now now let's create another vlan vlan 3 name <clears throat> management okay now let us assume we have one more vlan vlan 3 name uh sales okay so we have just created three villains on real time scenario okay now how we can allot this interface how we can allot the multiple interface to these villains okay how we can do that select the interface interface range fa 0 slash 1 2 4 first four interface will be the part of what the vlan 2 okay how we can do that interface fa 0 slash 1 2 4 switch port mode access switch port access vlan 2 okay i'm allotting first four interface to the vlan 2 now select another interface interface range fa 0 slash 1 2 1 2 uh, fa 0 slash 5 to 8 okay switch port mode access switch port switch port access vlan 3 okay next four interface allotted to what vlan 3 now let's do the configuration interface range fa0 slash uh, 9 to 12 9 to 12 okay switch port mode access switch port access vlan 2 okay now let's do the configuration interface range fa0 slash 9 to 12 9 to 12 we have a uh, total 24 ports dear when you will go to configure the in real time scenario you have to put a space after that okay switch port 
mode axis, switch port axis, VLAN 4. Okay. So it is saying that VLAN 4 is not exist. I think we have just created the wheel. Okay, okay, okay. We didn't have created the VLAN. Okay. Just create the VLAN. VLAN 4 name uh, management. Okay. Interface range FA0 slash 9 to 12. Put a space between 9 and dash. Okay. Switch port mode access. Switch port access VLAN. Okay, so we have just uh, created it allotted the interface to the VLAN. Okay, put exit here. If you want to check the previous configuration, that what we have done in this configuration, how we can do that by putting command show what show VLAN brief. So here you can see that. HR department has four interface interface FA0 slash one two three four sales department has three interface FA0 slash four five six uh, five six seven eight and management interface has four interfaces. What are these? 9, 10, 11, 12. So this is how you can configure in the real time. Okay. So dear all wait for some time in our next video we are going to configure what? The trunk port. Okay.